Hey guys, thank you for watching Designs by Danielle. Today I'm going to show you how I created a beautiful, elegant, secret garden bathroom. So stay tuned. First, I'm going to go ahead and show you my guest bathroom. This bathroom is located across from my living room space, so I consider it a high-traffic bathroom. I wanted the ambiance to represent tranquility. When you walk in my bathroom, I feel it's just not calm enough. So I'm going to go ahead and switch that up. But first, I'm going to get rid of my junk that was left here. So goodbye to this junk. Everything is now clean. So I'm going to start to decorate. Let me show you what I purchased. I purchased three decorative shelves from Walmart. I believe these were $8 a piece, and I'm going to be using these. I purchased this eucalyptus plant from Walmart as well for $2. Guys, this was a great find. Next, I purchased this glass. It was $2.97, but unfortunately, it did not make it because it ended up falling. These sea salt breeze candles were purchased at Dollar Tree, you guys. These artificial color shells were given to me by my husband, and I absolutely love them. I purchased this flower out of Walmart as well in the floral section, and I believe it was less than $3. It wasn't much. I bought a few of them. I also purchased this glass. I'm going to be placing this glass into a larger glass that I purchased from Walmart. And here's the larger glass. This was, I believe, $4.95. Yeah, and this is it. Guys, I'm going to be turning this wine rack into a towel holder. I'm going to use this salt and pepper shaker. And I'm going to be turning this into two small decorations. This bowl I'm going to be using as a towel dish. I also got this from the Dollar Tree, and I'm going to be using this to hang at the back of the door. This four-tier caddy was purchased out of Marshalls for $19.99. This was a great find. Here is my towel arrangement. This came out really nice. I absolutely love it, and it wasn't hard to make. Here is my floral arrangement. Unfortunately, I ended up dropping this one and had to make another one, but it's really pretty. Here's the caddy, guys. This has enough space to add in exactly what you need to add. It was $19.99. I added rope to the pictures that I already had because... I could not resist. I'm not doing my own DIY, so as you see, I made like this beautiful, elegant, beautiful, beautiful, elegant candle, and I thought it was really, really, really pretty. <laughs> I fell in love with this mason jar that says thanks for helping us grow on um, your shelves. You could add whatever you like. I placed some extra hand soap inside that plastic tube. I put some decorative soap, some bath salt, and just a dispenser in there. There uh, you see the salt and pepper shakers, which are now my small little uh, decor items. And those candles from Dollar Tree, they came out really pretty. And I just added a room spray that I purchased from Marshalls. These towels are so cute. They were the perfect fit. I got these from Walmart. And I believe I paid $1.97 or $2.97. Cinnamon apple. And here is the second vase that I made after the first one broke. It is very, very pretty. So guys, this is my tissue holder and I made this a few years ago. So I've had it for some time. I cannot wait to see your designs. Above my toilet, you already saw that towel holder. 
you could glue it together or you could just simply roll it up and use it as needed. I just hung that towel right over the rack and put up this Be Strong and Courageous War frame that I love. So guys, here is the outcome. It came out really, really pretty and very, very calm. Here I am appreciating the items that I made in my DIYs. I really, really love them all. And thank you guys for watching Designs by Danielle. I hope you enjoyed and I hope I encouraged you guys to rejig your bathroom over for the new year. If you like the video guys, please give it a thumb up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching Designs by Thank